Hit Film Sensei here. Today in this video, we're gonna talk about how to do a slow motion video where you film the video at a higher frame rate to make that happen. So in this case, my phone has the ability to record at 120 frames per second, although it says 119 here, but it's 120 frames per second, right? Uh, and if I just play this at the project setting of 30 frames per second, then it should be one quarter speed, right? So I grab my footage and I drag it down in here. Oh, it looks so good. Uh, wait, do you want to change this? Uh, no, I just want it to be 30 frames per second. Okay, and so now I play it. Well, now, wait a minute. It's, uh, what's going on here? Why is this, uh, it's at regular speed? And you go, dude, what happened? Well, the thing about it is, is that hit film automatically conforms this to whatever uh, frame rate you're you're using, which is really cool because if you have several different types of footage and they're all different frame rates or something like that, it'll automatically go ahead and make them all this, you know, work with each other in a friendly fa fashion so they'll all play well nicely, right? But what if I actually want it to be in slow motion? In other words, I don't want it to play well with the rest of the clip. Well, here's what you do. What you do is, is you go to the media itself and you click on this little icon right here, this little cog wheel, and it says frame rate. And I'm going to uncheck that, and I'm going to say, make that 30 frames per second. Click OK. Now when I go to drag this down, and I won't need the audio, so I'm just going to hold Alt. And then it says, do you want to? It doesn't matter if I do or not, so I'm going to say no. And now when I go to play it, I think I will do this, though, and I will make this fit to frame. And when I go to play it, it actually plays it at its native 120 frames per second in a project that's 30 frames per second. So therefore, it is one quarter speed genuinely. And that's how you convert that. So in a nutshell, that's what you do. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Otherwise, thanks for watching. If you would like to keep up with the latest tutorial videos from HitFilm Sensei, consider liking the HitFilm Sensei Facebook page following the HitFilm Sensei Twitter feed, and subscribing to the HitFilm Sensei YouTube channel. The links are in the description below. A new video comes out every Friday, and thanks for your support.